this is your time the bible says david in his time he served the purpose of god in his generation the question is what are you doing in your generation help me ask your neighbor what are you doing in your generation what are you doing with your time as other people are serving the will of god for you what are you doing as other people are serving the will of god you are in clubs at your age you are drinking alcohol at your age you are sleeping with men is that what you can do in your generation in your time what will be said of you when you get out of your generation what will be said of you when your time is up and they are burying your body to decay in the ground i want you to wake up every day asking yourself that question i have served the purpose of god in my generation and i am still doing so and i pray that more davids will arise out of this congregation in jesus mighty name that it will be said of you that in your time you served the will of god the purpose of god in your generation that by the time you died you didn't have regrets of what you should have done in your life don't live a life of regrets i want you to make a decision how is your life going to be summed up if you have not yet given your life to jesus christ your life is in crisis the beginning of understanding the will of God for your life is accepting Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior of your life. I don't know what the past 24 years of my life would have been if they were not in Jesus. If you are here and you are not born again, I'm here to tell you that you need Jesus in your life. That you'll fulfill the purpose of God in your life in your time. And that by the time you get out of this life, it will not be wasted, it will not be full of regrets. So that 24 years from this day, you will have a testimony like mine that once upon a time they told us about david they preached to us about the purpose and the will of god and that day i chose to give my life to jesus and this is what he has made my life to be that should be your story without jesus you are only studying to become an educated devil without jesus even a cockroach will scare you in broad daylight demons will hit you you will experience death while you are still alive. How many of you here, you have kept postponing this decision, but you want to give your life to Jesus today. Lift up your hand. 